Surveillance video near 41st and Madison shows a five-year-old girl running from danger Monday evening. A truck crashes into a motorcycle, throwing the riders off. The motorcycle then slamming into a parked truck. A fire ignites. Neighbors grab hoses to tame the flames, while others out of frame perform CPR on the motorcyclists. It lets me know that there's, there's still good people out there in this world. But 48-year-old Daniel McDonald on his dream Harley Davidson did not make it. His wife, 49-year-old Patricia, by his side during his last moments. All she told me is, is she kept turning over to look at him and yelling at him, don't you leave me, don't you die. The couple's daughter, Melissa Perales, <laughs> is thankful her mom is recovering after several surgeries, but she says she could never forgive this man. 34-year-old Joseph Modish, booked for felony motor vehicle homicide, accused of running the stop sign. He took my father away from me. He took my kids' as grandfather. Tuesday, strangers like Cicely Lorma lay down flowers and balloons to make sure Daniel's death is not in vain. I know it impacted a lot of people in different ways, and I'm pretty sure just like it impacted me, it's going to impact other families too and how they see things. She and others rendered aid to the victims right after the crash. We started doing chest compressions and doing what we could. And, uh, took off my shirt to try to dampen some of the bleeding. Now this community and a mourning family beg for drivers to be careful. People need to pay attention.